it feels Hello. good to be back. Yeah, well, surrounded well, by all these beautiful Welcome women. back. <laughs> Very nice. You're looking great, too. Oh, thank you. Thank and you. And just before you came out, we were talking about Dolly Parton. Yeah. Who said in an interview that she wanted to die on stage. So people are dying to know. <laughs> are the Jonas Brothers going to be singing at 90? You know, yeah. if we're lucky, sure, right? We, you know, we get to do this constantly. We're about to head out on our biggest tour ever, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. um, wow. Starts on the 12th at Yankee Stadium, which is oh. crazy. It's a lot. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah, no, so we're doing, uh, we're doing something different. We're doing five albums in one night. So we're playing all our music that oh. we released. Oh, wow. Yes, yeah, trying to figure, it's in the long one, but it'll it's be good. Long one. <laughs> yeah, and when you're out there at 90, Mick Jagger's still gonna be out yeah, there. You know, yeah, I said Danny's wearing her Dolly Parton outfit right now. Oh, yeah. I am obsessed with it, you look yeah. so beautiful. And you just walked out to the mega Jonas Brothers oh, hit, I Cool. Love it so much. Thank you. Which this summer is most definitely not cool. It's very, very hot. Oh, yeah. What's so, how on? are you guys doing? And give us a quick update on the family. Craziness. Yes, yeah, craziness. Ways. We're uh, we're gearing up for you know gearing up to tour. leave for tour. So so we're gonna leave. So that's always a fun thing. But right now we're about to go on our. July was essentially our month off. You know we released an album this year, and that was kind of a lot of work. And of course <laughs> we're working on. There's a beach in my bedroom. So really our big focus in July is just spending time with our girls. Yeah. Um, you know right now and. Yeah. Then we're going away, and then they're going to start traveling with us. It'll be great. Oh, that'll be nice. Oh, it's, so it's a family operation. Yeah. So the Jonas Brothers have had an incredibly busy year. You all received a star in the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Congratulations. Made your Broadway Thank stage you. debut. Released your sixth studio album. And, of course, the tour is coming out. You, you gave us a little preview of. So of all five albums, what else can we expect? Well, it's, it's a lot, right? Um, we were talking about it a ton, like, how do we do this? Because we want to play all five albums in one night, so do we play it in order? Do you play it, you know, sequentially? Do you play it randomly and just throw, throw people for complete whiplash? You know, start with here and go there. So, yeah. but I think we figured it out. We spent a lot of time in music rehearsal. And then, of course, I had to get her approval because she's like, no, 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 you can't play that together. I have to hear it this way. So, <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I love that. Yeah, what about all the dancing and the movement? We don't really dance that much at all. Okay, Thank so God. You can Trust sing. me, you don't want that. <laughs> um, you know, we play, you can, uh, you we can sing. Belt yeah, them no, out but then. it's a very big a stage to run around on. So. Yeah. 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 Well, so it's always fun seeing that you guys bring the kids on tour. Do they realize like what superstars their dad and their uncles and their aunts are? I feel like I try to keep on like telling them like, do you realize this is really like not normal? And uh, <laughs> I think Alina is mm -hmm. now. And then Valentina is more like, I miss daddy. I want daddy to come oh. home and all that stuff. <laughs> but Alina and sometimes Alina, she like says, you know, like I'm a rock star too. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, so. They're going to be perfectly fine. Yeah. <laughs> exactly as well. They are. Well, Danielle, this new album is said to be a love letter to the brothers' wives. Yeah. Nick's wife's Priyanka Chopra, Joe's wife, Sophie Turner, and of course you. Mm -hmm. There is even a song based uh, solely on your relationship. Mm -hmm. So how do you guys make your marriage work, and how do you react when he comes to you and say, babe, this one's for you? I, well... <laughs> <laughs> Can I say Yeah, go okay. for it. You say whatever you want. <laughs> I think I waited 13 years for this song. This, this Come on, song. really? I know, but it, I know. it was the best way. It had to be right. So it, take, exactly. it, took, it took time for it to be perfect. This one's called Vacation Eyes. We literally met on vacation in the Bahamas. Oh. We lived in the same area in New Jersey. We, I moved to L.A. with the guys doing what we do. And it took us going on two separate family vacations to meet in the Bahamas. So the song's called the Vacation Eyes. It's on the album, the new album. Are you, are you guys living in Miami now? No, no. Joe is. Oh, okay. um, Joe was. Um, and, but we're right here, right over the bridge, yeah. right by. No, mm. and I also understand you've been approached uh, about possibly joining the cast of The Real Housewives. The more I hear Jersey. about it, maybe you should just do it. <laughs> oh, I've been wow. About it a lot. But please make sure you weren't, you're not committing any crime. Right? <laughs> well, that's yeah. the thing. Yeah. 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 Like, I yeah. feel yeah. like I would get ripped apart. The women, the women, <laughs> sometimes there's a little psycho. And stuff. <laughs> you know what? We I'm actually all live far. in the area, so we know the families pretty well. Yeah. I just I told her, I'm like, babe, we're busy enough. It's cool. Like, Which yeah. ones? Yeah. 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 I have to deal with my whole family history. Fam no, I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> it's probably like a reality oh. show by itself. Yeah, yeah. It's I would watch that reality show. You yeah. seem very <laughs> nice. You, you don't you. want it. <laughs> you seem very nice. You seem very nice. <laughs> now, Kevin, you and Danielle are teaming up for your second yes. picture book. You, so were here for, you were here on the show for the first. This is called There's a Beach in My Bedroom. Yeah. It looks like you got the girls into the action. Yeah. Uh, I there's an Instagram video. Yeah, yeah. There, there it goes. They're, they're unboxing and they're... they're oh. They're doing the stuff. They're helping us sign and pack them away. They're they were doing so the excited stuff. about it. So, happy. so tell us about the book. So uh, the book is, is really special. This is the second one we've done. Um, this one's called The Beach in My Bedroom. As we all know, disappointment for kids can be a little hard to understand. Mm -hmm. um, this is the whole family is about to go out on vacation and go to the beach. Sadly, 
it's raining, you can't oh. do that. So it's about turning that moment into something fun as a family, even without having exactly what you're supposed to have. And I think we all deal with that, whether it's yeah. adults, children, it's hard to like explain to them that you're not gonna get your way today. And when, yeah. when it's not because they did something wrong or whatever, it's just because life took a turn. Well, listen, if global warming continues, I know, we're going right? to end up with a beach in our I, I, Seriously, <laughs> it feels that way, doesn't it? Um, no, and we're just, it's constant with them. We always wanna make them feel special. And it's yeah. about making those moments memorable. Yeah. And with us, as busy as we are, um, I think it's about time and mm -hmm. being present for me specifically, yeah. especially when I'm on tour, like I'll fly home on a day off. Yeah. Like I'll do like three days in a row, take a red eye, land, be there for 12 hours, go right back, yeah. just so I could be there. Yeah. Um, and then they come visit and do the same. So this story is about that. We're really happy that we could put it out there and the girls love it because they're, it's not exactly our family, but it's kind of them a little yeah, bit yeah. emulated. Yeah. Inspired. Inspired. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I've yeah. seen that at the beginning yeah. of the movie. Yeah. Now, Kevin, before you go, we, you posted such a relatable TikTok recently oh. when it came to helping your daughter with her third grade. <laughs> Yeah, we're done. Let's oh, I well. can't do that. No, don't get stressed. It's gonna get figured out. Oh, deep conversation that the Waffle House has. Hey, strong father and a determined mother. Oh, that's why some nights we try to kid each other. But you know it's always love. <laughs> yeah. It's different now. Third and fourth grade math is not what we learned. It's like, I, thank God I did okay in math. Like I could yeah. got a, but the way they word these problems. It's is different it's now. So ridiculous. It is, it is it's intended so... to break yeah. someone's brain. It, it I is. Swear to God. I told my great grand, I said, I can't help you. Yeah. I know. I, I so. can't even read the question. Yeah, but what, what grade what is want. Charlie in? She's in the third grade. Yeah, I yeah, remember that's when it gets being hard. about it's to hard. Walk. I remember walking on stage, FaceTiming Alina, and being like, hey, all right, I'm going to call you back when we, when I have, when the guys do their solo right. songs, I'm going to call you back and we'll finish the paperwork before bed. Because I take a picture of it. And yeah, I'm she like, sends it to me. She's insane. like, I don't know what to do. It's insane. It's insane. Well, I'm it's glad that I'm not the only one crying. Oh, no, about. you are not. No. <laughs> so listen, thank you, Kevin and Danielle. The new book is called There's a Beach in My Bedroom. All right, all right. Would you like to have it? Would you like to have it? 